Yo, 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 what's poppin'? I'm Jacques Slade, and today we're taking a closer look at the latest party box from JBL, the Encore Essential. It may be small, but this thing packs a punch and can do a lot of things you find on the bigger party box 110 and 710. Let's take a closer look. When you get the speaker out of the box, you have three pieces, the speaker, the power cable, and the quick start guide. Once you get it plugged up and starting to charge, let's take a look at a few of the options you can access directly on the device. Although you can also access many of these through the Party Box app, but we'll get to that later. Now, even though the speaker comes with an AC cord to keep you powered up, the speaker also has a battery. Like some of its bigger brothers, this one can get up to six hours of playtime. And if the vibes are really going, the Encore features a light show on the front that can be controlled directly through the app or directly on the device itself via the control panel. And speaking of the control panel, let's break it down really quickly. You have the power button, the Bluetooth button, the lights button, the bass boost button, which has three different levels. And in the middle, you have the play button, which also controls the volume when you turn it left or right. Connecting the Encore to your device is as easy as connecting a pair of JBL headphones. Press the Bluetooth button, then hop into your phone's Bluetooth settings and select the device from the listed options. If you want a wire connection, you can go old school and use an aux cable. Or if you have a USB drive, you can connect it directly to the device and it will play back select formats like WAV, MP3, and WMA. Quick pro tip, the USB connection doubles as a charging port. So if you need some extra juice while you're out and about or even when you're plugged in, you have access directly on the Encore. To access the USB, you have to go through the back panel and you'll find a few more options there as well. The true wireless stereo button that you use to connect to other JBL speakers so you can sync up and have your own personal light show. You'll also find an input for a microphone and the gain knob. Though you can control the Encore Essential through the app, you also have hard controls on the device. Double tap the play button, it'll skip to the next track. And if you want to repeat, you can press it three times. When you are connected to the JBL Party Box app, you unlock a few more options that give the speaker a new life. Not only can you control the lights on the front of the Encore, but you also get access to some DJ tools that let you add some extra flavor to the party on the fly or just give someone a round of applause. With its smaller size, the Encore Essential is easily small enough to take along on a trip for the weekend. It's IPX4 rated, so a few splashes aren't going to hurt it, and with the options to go wired or wireless, the music options are all in your hands, literally. The grip at the top of the speaker is made to make it easier to carry. Did I mention that you can actually turn the lights on or off in the app as well, and they even have a color picker if you want to spice up the party with your own theme? So much to explore with this speaker. Okay, that's gonna do it for me. Thank you for watching. I'm Jacques Slade, and I hope you enjoy your new JBL Party Box Encore Essential. I'll see you next time. Peace.